Fun team to watch. David, thank you. And a look at the starters for the Cavaliers. They've got Markinen, Lavert out there with Garland. Then it's Okoro, and it's Brown in at the five, roaming the paint. And for the Nets, we've got Irving. Bruce Brown is out there with Durant. Then there's Andre Drummond, and it's Curry in at the shooting guard position. And for those teams that suffered a harsh ending to last season, Greg, what are they feeling here on opening night? I mean, motivated. You, you think about that kind of thing all summer, and the chance for retribution starts now. No good on the three. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. Now, here's Markinen. Brown with a screen on Irving. The baseline J. And it's sent back by KD. They break it out. Five on three. Curry against LeVert. Curry kicks to Drummond. Trying to find Durant. He's got it now. It's over Garland. And it's Durant. That time on the assist by Drummond. Yeah, you're not going to see KD miss from that range very often. And here's Cleveland. Outside Garland over Urban. Garland with the bucket. Guys, that's just really unstoppable. He poses a ton of matchup problems for whomever he's facing. Irving passes to Brown. Back to Irving. There's the drive. Good for the basket. Starting off one for one with that shot. Love how effective Irving is on the drive. His head is up. He just cuts right through the defense. It's Garland with the ball for Cleveland. Down kicks to Garland. The pass to Levert. Kicks it out to Markinen. Three pointers off the mark. The Nets have gone two or three here to start off the game. Levert against Kurt. He takes it in. The kick out to Irving. Left side, Brown. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. It goes on Isaac Okoro. The Nets shooting their first free throws of the game right now. Shooting two. First one falls for. And Brown drops them both. Here in the first quarter with about two minutes gone by. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need the basket. Brown sends a screen for Garland. Levert, just five to shoot. Shoots over Curry. A nice shot by Levert. And got to push Levert out of that area because he's very comfortable looking to score from there. Durant, the pass to Drummond. Here's Brown. Back to Drummond. In the corner, Irving with it. Over Brown. And it's blocked by Brown. It's Levert on the wing. Guarded by Kirk. Some nice passing by Cleveland here. The wide open look here for Garland. And no good. Had a chance to take the lead there. Last outing for the Nets. They won that game against the Knicks in New York. KD sets the pick for Brown. This is to KD. And they recover. Tries again. The shot's good. Brown making the play. KD's got his second bucket of the game to go. KD took some time there. Measured up the situation. And knew when to get his shot off. Okoro setting the pick for Garland. 
outside, marking it. Pass to Brock. Now the dish to Okoro. And there's the call on Andre Drummond. That is his first foul of the game. And here in the first quarter, with a little over three and a half minutes played, Avert kicks to Okoro. Six on the shot clock. Right wing, parking in from outside. And he keeps adding strength and conditioning through the years. A big help to Kevin Durant there on the defensive end. And marking in out of Finland, Greg, was one of the hot names in free agency this last summer. And surprisingly, didn't get an extension before the season. Just hard to find seven-footers that can shoot like Markkinen. You knew at least a few teams would try and lure him away. How about that strong defensive performance for this half's mobile one block? And an early swap like that can really set the tone. Now the shooters will be feeling his presence. For the Cleveland Cavaliers, they come in off the loss to the Magic in Orlando. Pass to Levert. Passes it to Markinen. And another miss by Cleveland. Really excellent defense there. They know he's capable of knocking it down from the outside, and they could not have played him better. Oh, Kevin, not a petty, not a manny, but a face. Oh, a bounce to the ounce, Greg? Yeah, showing off the bunnies. Now, here's Garland. He had 27 points last game. Brown with a screen on Irving. Garland with it, picked up by Brown. And there's the call on Andre Drummond. That's foul number two for him. Nicholas Claxton's checked in for Andre Drummond. Here's Markinen. He had 25 points last game. Levert the pass to Garland. That's good. And it's Levert with the assist. Garland's got five now. Well, good to see Garland score the ball without dominating. Nets leading by three. Curry finds Brown. Hands it from downtown. Both teams running perimeter-oriented plays that are working. Well, both of them looking towards the three-point line, and I like to see that, especially when the results are made buckets. Here's Brown following the three-pointer by Brooklyn. And that kind of defense ain't going to get it done. Gee, we don't see those kinds of dunks out of him all the time, but we know he's got it in him. Well, any guy can throw it down against air defending him. Plenty of room, so not so amazing. What does amaze me, though, is that no one came over to contest the play. Claxed in the pass to Durant. And Okoro pulls it down. The Cavaliers trail by four. Now the pass to Levert. Okoro with it. Down low. Free throw line jump shot. No good on that one. Time for some consideration in the passing category, maybe, Kevin. The shot is just not on. Get somebody else going. And it's Brown missing. Well, you, you have to like their work on the boards, Kevin, particularly here to start the game. Garland against Irving. Garland kicks to Markinen. And another three for Cleveland. Already a solid shooter. When you play off marketing, you risk getting burned. And the Nets with possession here. And here's Irving. Outside curve. Takes the three. It's not going to go for him. Yeah, and you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. Garland, the pass to Markinen. Brown feeling out a bit. Here's a Coro. The shot's good. Brown making the play. And the Cavaliers lead by one. Well, Isaac is one of those physical guards out there that can back down guys and take some hits. And the jam by Kevin Durant. 
and see the action, getting others involved. He does it time and time again. Nice to play with a point guard that takes pride in playmaking. It makes you move around just a little bit faster to get open spots. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. And a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for Brooklyn. And so far, these guys have done a fantastic job finding the open man and getting some easy baskets. Another part of the game tonight where they've been effective is to get points in the paint. And the first one drops. Edwards, he's checked in for Brooklyn. Mills comes in for Curry. So he hits both. And it's Mills with the ball for the Brooklyn Nets. They trail by one. Here's Claxton. He's covered by Brown. And that one's good, Irving. Some close defense is not going to scare off Kyrie Irving. He gets in there, he's physical right back, and he gets the finish. Cleveland's gotten just two of six to fall from three-point range so far in the first. Katie against Love. Rondo. Another shot. And it's good on the way up. When you get into the painted area, Rondo's got great touch on the inside. The Nets have gone 7 of 15 from the field at this point. Now here's Mills. Guarded closer. Pass to Edwards. Fires from deep. Here's Claxton. Count the bucket. And he's got a free throw coming up as well. Really strong rebounding on the interior, and he gets the easy putback. And he's got his first chance at the line here. One shot. On the free throw, no good. Cavaliers trailing. Pass to Love to the left side wing. Left side, Brown. Brown sets a screen for Ronda. Just four to shoot. Cleveland needs to get a shot off here. Offensive rebound. Here's Brown. Somehow ignores the tight D and gets the way up. Brown's got six. We'll see if they can finally hold on to a lead. It's been back and forth all night. Well, you can tell they really want to increase this lead. They can't keep letting them take it from them. Now here's Edwards. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Hangs on the trifecta. That's where he is just so effective. Patty Mills from deep. His range pretty much limitless, but his confidence is through the roof. Here's Love, and the layup is good. Love's got it all tied up now for the Cavs. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. And it's Irving missing. Things are going south right now. This is not the type of shooting that his teammates expect from him. Rondo passes to Love. Oh, drew the foul and almost hit the three-point bucket. And he'll go to the line to shoot three. Kevin Love was just so dominant in the early part of his career, averaging a double-double even over the last decade. If you look at the numbers, five All-Star games and a key player in that Cavs 2016 title run. And he hits the first of three. Greg, let me tell you a little-known fact about Kevin Love. He played Little League Baseball with... Clay Thompson. <laughs> They've been friends since they were eight. Imagine if they were teaming up on the court instead of the diamond. Even at eight years old, that's an inside-out combo that probably could have dominated some high school teams. And boy, you, you got to hand it to Kevin Love. Opening up about mental health, 
helping to raise awareness on a subject that affects so many around the globe. Yeah, I think both Kevin Love and DeMar DeRozan from the player's standpoint did a great job of shedding light in that area. But Adam Silver who, himself, who went to a conference and talked a lot about what players are dealing with and how the stresses of social media and the pressures of playing are wearing on them, the league as a whole, players, management, and the commissioner himself have done a great job of providing this kind of safe environment for players to be courageous enough to step out and say, I need help. Cavaliers leading. Rondo with the ball. Picked up by Edwards. Rondo dishes to Love. And it's Kyrie Irving with the rebound. Brooklyn's gotten just two of six to fall from three-point range so far in the first. 141 left in the first quarter of the game. It's blocked. That's out of bounds. Brooklyn will retain possession. Shot from the inbound. The Cavaliers shooting 47% from the field to start things off. Oh, he blocked it and deflects off the backboard. Edwards passes to Aldridge. Tipped away. And here we go. Fast break. Love's got it. And a wide open look for Rondo. Good on the three-point shot. Rondo's got five. Better outside when he gets into a rhythm or when he gets his feet set. Rondo's smart at knowing when to fire. Nice ball movement by Brooklyn. There's the pick. Down to five on the shot clock. There's the three. And there's Edwards on the assist by Irving. Edwards got his second bucket of the night. And I like the back and forth here showing confidence from Rain. It seems like they're going to find out who can make the deepest threes. Right now it's a shootout. And so it's Cleveland with it following the three-pointer by Brooke. Out to the right wing. Love finds Brown. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Brown's got his third bucket of the night. Now Love has a knack for recognizing when a teammate's going to break wide open. Outside, Edwards. Irving sets a screen for Edwards. In the hoop for his third make from the field. He's three for four thus far in the contest. And it's Rondo with the ball for the Cavaliers. to the inside here's Love nice move hits the layup after the sweet pump fake to freeze the D he has seven. Oh, he's taking it right at the defense it's Kevin Love right now Sniffing out some offensive opportunities. And at the end of one, both teams putting up some points. Cavaliers lead by three. Live from Brooklyn, New York, you're watching 2K Sports. And one of the game's elite closers, Kyrie Irving, describes his approach down. Uh, you know, for me, I just try to feel up. And you know, Greg, that's reminiscent of quotes we used to hear from Kobe Bryant, how certain moves and possessions set up defenders for the next time. Well, Kyrie definitely has that Mamba mentality. Kobe was a big influence on him, as we all know. And close game underway so far. We'll see if either of these teams can jump out in the second quarter. And taking a look at the Cavaliers' performance here, what do you guys see? Well, this is the edge that great rim protection can give you. Yeah, you can't be careless with your shot selection out there because some of them are getting thrown back. We've got Brown. 
Bills out there with Seth Curry. Then there's Andre Drummond, and it's Claxton in at the four spot. So that's the lineup for Brooklyn. Garland with the bucket. Garland's got the lead up to five now for Cleveland. And that's just a tough shot from Garland taking the contact. And it's Drummond with the jam. And, and although an undersized center, more than making up for it with some serious hops. Well, Cleveland shooting has been terrific. 54% on the game. He has a chance now to catch up with the fourth member of our crew, Hall of Famer David Aldrin. Thank you, Kevin. After making the finals four straight years from 2015 to 2018, there have been some lean years lately for the Cavaliers. Over the last three seasons, they've only won a couple more games than they did in a single season, the title season of 2016. Coach J.B. Bickerstaff says the losing is tough on everybody, but I look forward to the journey ahead. Kevin, back to you. What do they say, D.A.? The journey is the reward. Thanks. And Brooklyn making a change here. Durant's checked in. One shot. One drops, he ties it up. Greg, you're a former player, and now the father of a young NBA star. What's it like to see the next generation of NBA talent move into the league? Oh, it's an incredible feeling because we all feel like we're a part of this NBA family. And to see the stars we have today, the character they have, the way they approach the game, man, this is the best time ever to be an NBA fan. Quarter number two with just over a minute gone. Passes to Levert. From deep. Here's Love. And good work on the boards. They pick up the second chance points. Love's got nine points. Yeah, when you give up these second chance opportunities, I don't know what you expect. Kevin Love is going to find a way to get in there and make something good happen. Drummond with a screen on Markinen. KD with it. Guarded now by Kevin Love. Yep, it counts. Well, that's how you draw it up right there. A screen to shed the defense. A quick move to the bucket. And you get the lay-in. Cavaliers have gone 2-3 or three from the field here to open the second quarter. Out to the wing. Love against Drummond. Love kicks to a car roll. The pass to Levert. Five on the clock. Markinen sets the pick for Levert. Shoots over Curry. And that one hits back iron. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just looks like he wins on it. And the jam by Kevin Durant. That's impressive. Kevin Durant just getting up and throwing it down. The Cavaliers trailing. Pass to Levert. Cleveland moving it around. Okoro passes to Markinen. Kicks to Okoro. Markinen is screen on Brown. Just five on the clock. And there's the foul. It'll go on Bruce Brown. That's his first foul. Yeah, clearly struggling here with the foul. Still early. And just one more will put him over the limit. We're just over two and a half minutes into the second quarter. A drive by Garland. That's good, and it's his fourth basket of the game. He's a strong four for six. Now Garland did a nice job. Pretty lethal off the bounce. And great body control on that drive. And so Curry will bring it up for the Brooklyn Nets. He dishes it to Durant. Shades over Markinen. The shot by KD. No good. Well, maybe not the best shot against that kind of defense, but... He still has the ability to knock that kind of shot down. And it's Levert missing. Brooklyn's gone 3-7 tonight from three-point territory. Durant kicks to Curry. Pass to Mills. The feed now to Durant. Sinks that one from the post. Durant's got 14. Making the easy shots and the tough shots. He's on top of his game. And just over three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Harlan finds Love. Out left of the wing. Back to Levert. 
to the wing on the left. There's Garland. And trying for the go-ahead basket. It doesn't go in. Drummond sets the screen for Kerr. Into the lane. Drummond trying to get himself free. Great D that time from Levert. Cleveland's gone 0-2 from deep here in the second. Passes it to Garland. And here is a core roll. Covered by Mills. A nice shot by Okoro. Okoro's got the game tied up here for the Cavs. Okoro, he's going to make a lot of physical points like that throughout his career. And the pass to KD. Over Markinen. And it's Durant. That time on the assist by Mills. Durant's got eight here in the quarter. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket coming off a pretty pass. Levert the pass to Markinen. Outside Garland. Shot clock at six. And he drives in. Rebound, Brooklyn. Brown's got four rebounds in this game. KD with it. Now defended by Markinen. Curry deciding where to go with it. Has to Drummond. Back to Curry. The Nets need to get a shot off here. He gets it in there. And it's a four-point Nets lead. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. And for old-school centers like Andre Drummond, the modern NBA posing some challenges. He's not quite the floor spacer. Well, and he's not, but still on the defensive end, I think, G.A., if you have a guy that, that kind of size and that kind of athleticism, Against certain teams that play another compact big, he becomes a guy to clog up the lane, block shots, and still be a deterrent on the inside. KD against Markinen. They double team KD, and the layup's good off the glass. KD's got 18 points in the game. And he's starting to show that killer instinct this quarter, looking to extend the lead. Outside, Markinen. To Garland. Love with the screen for Garland. And it's sent back by Drummond. And how about the swap? Great timing as Drummond uses his height, gets up there, and throws that one away. Brown the pass to Drummond. Got a piece of it. Drummond working against Garland. Feeds it to Markinen. Shoots over Mills. Markinen can't get it to go. Nets leading by three. Here's Mills. He had 15 points last out. And the officials call him for a three-second violation. And now here's the 2K leaderboard with the list of the NBA's best teams from three-point land a year ago. The Nets second. Just tremendous accuracy from the three-point line last season. Instead of heaving up every opportunity and quick chance that they got, it was about ball movement and finding the open shooter. Once again, off the mark by Cleveland. This feels like it's snowballed a little bit on them. The more he tries to shoot his way out of this slump, the worse it seems to get. They need him to get it together. Back to Durant. Fires the three. Out of bounds. Cleveland takes possession. And checking out the numbers for Levert. He had a strong showing last season. Around 20 points per game last season. Five assists and four rebounds. And you look at the numbers he's been putting up. Fantastic scoring production from him. Yeah, hard to ask for anything more at this point. He's really stepped up and he's really delivered. Akoro with it. Back to Garland. Here's the three. And Curry pulls it down. Curry's got his fifth rebound in this one. stick to -itiveness. You heard that? Kevin Love just showed you what it's all about. And so it's Mills who will bring it up for the Nets. And the first timeout call to the game for Brooklyn.
So for the Nets, Nicholas Claxton's checked in for Drummond. Edwards comes in for Bruce Brown. And Irving subbed in for Patty Mills. And then for Cleveland, Stevens is checked in. And it's Jetty Osman in for Karis LeVert. Defense shaking their heads. No idea how to stop him in this quarter. He's got him on the ropes. Rondo kicks to Osman. Durant with the steal. KD draws the double. Waxed in the pass to Curry. He doesn't hit that one. Excellent D there from Markinen. Rondo against Irving. It's stolen by Edward. Irving looking for an opening. Yeah, clearly he had an established position there. LaMarcus Aldridge has checked in for the Nets. And Cleveland with a change here, too. Brown's checked in. Here's Claxton. His last outing, he had eight points. Aldridge inside. Makes it off the glass. And the Nets lead by five. Now sometimes you're helpless to stop LaMarcus Aldridge. So big and assertive down there in the paint. Cleveland's gotten into trouble with the three ball in the second quarter. Only hitting one of five attempts. Round kicks to Osmond. Love with the screen on Kirk. Just three to shoot. Osmond, the pass to Rondo. Second shot opportunity. Oh, that's blocked. Outside, Edwards. Irving finds Curry. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. They've been able to have some team success in this game despite what's been an awful shooting night for them. Here's Stevens. And another miss by Cleveland. Nets leading by five. One fifty-six left in the first half. Outside Curry. And it's blocked by Brown. Curry against Rondo. To end the cold streak. Brown trying to free himself up. Curry is a nice D. Brooklyn's gone 0-2 from deep here in the second. Over in the corner, Edward. The Cavaliers pull it in. Brown's got rebound number five here tonight. Brown with a screen on Irving. Here's Osman. And it's sent back by Aldridge. He's become a defensive anchor here for this team over the past couple seasons. Great timing on the block there. One fifteen left in the first half. Brooklyn leading by five. to Edwards. Irving finds Curry. Shot clock at five. And it's blocked by Brown. Here's Osman, guarded by Curry. Here's Stevens over Edwards. And it's sent back by Aldridge. Goes up at the strike. The rebound by Kevin Love. The Cavaliers trail by five. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Here's Rondo. The Cavaliers again can't hit. Here's Irving. Well placed jumper from the free throw line. Irving's got his third basket of the night. Kyrie making that look effortless. That shot is so well within his comfort zone. Pass to Love. Fader on the way. And so it's the Brooklyn Nets bringing the quarter to a close with a seven-point lead. And it's been their rugged defense setting the tone. 
And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks a lot. Kyrie, what were you all focusing on coming into the game tonight? You gotta come out with a you know intense focus and intensity that you know other teams can't match. Just doing whatever it takes to you know keep our tempo. Um, you know guys are in a in a great rhythm when we have a great tempo. So just trying to get everybody involved and do whatever it takes to win. Well, we'll see if you can keep playing at your pace in the second half. Thanks a lot. Back to you, Kevin. All right, Dave. Thank you. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow right here on 2K Sports. Welcome, everybody. The story tonight has been a solid showing through the first half for the Brooklyn Nets. They're running some great offense right now, working the ball in the good spots, taking what the defense gives them, not forcing up shots. We'll see if they can maintain that discipline in the second half. And let's take a moment now to look at the upcoming schedule. What's on the docket? And that'll do it for halftime. We send you back to Kevin Harlan, who has the second half call. And happy you could join us. We've got two quarters left to go in regulation. What a game we're seeing from Kevin Durant. And guys, we saw just how tough he can be with the step to the rim. Great job of just attacking that first half. Yeah, nice job of carving his way to the inside with some ease. Not much resistance out there. And if you're just joining us in this one, first half is in the books. One half to go. It's Garland with the ball for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Seven-point differential. Our second half of basketball. And presented by Gatorade. Let's see who's all fueled up and on the floor to start the third. And so in the game for the Cavaliers, Arkinen is out there with Brown. Then it's Darius Garland. Then there's Karis LeVert. And it's Okoro in at the small forward position. Irving dishes to Brown. To the middle. Durant down low. He's guarded by Markinen. And that one's good. Durant. Yeah, going to be tough for the defense to find a way to slow down KD. If he stays aggressive, it's going to be a big night. Passes it to Levert. And there's the foul. It'll go on Bruce Brown. That's foul number two for him. And now let's revisit that exceptional mobile one block. Yeah, quick thinking pays off big. What a block. And for those of you turning in, we're about a minute into the second half. And there's the pass to Garland over Irving. Kyrie more and more wants to take pride on the defensive end, so encouraging to see him out there with a hand up on that one. Curry against Markinen. It's Curry with the drive. Nets passing it around. Five to shoot. Here's Drummond again with the block. A, a defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Greg protecting the rim. Love the hustle. The Cavaliers trail by seven. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Outside, marking it. To the paint. A nice shot by Levert. Hey guys, the D has to show a little more fight on the interior than they did on that trip. Nets leading by five. Pass to Brown. The feed to Irving. Solid play in the low block, and that one's good. Eight points for Kyrie Irving. And Kyrie constantly beating his defenders and so good in those tight quarters with the basketball. Arkinen passes to Garland. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Garland's got 15. And obviously his momentum from the last game has carried over here tonight. Yeah, and the coach pretty smart for zoning in on him and giving him opportunities to stay with that confident play. 
Outside Irving. Durant for three. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Irving's got three assists now in this one. Well, there's a nice answer from an operator in Kevin Durant. You hit a three, you know he's coming back at you. Lavert the pass to Brock. Back to Lavert. And it's sent back by Truman. Their game plan needs to change if they're going to get out of this hole because he is just not there offensively. Irving from long range. Oh, my. He'll go to the line with a chance for a four-point play. Here's Garland picks one up. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. The Nets making a switch here. Mills has checked in. One falls for Irving. You think about when Kyrie is healthy and he works himself into a great rhythm. He is the ultimate difference maker. Just someone who can get in there and take over a game and a franchise and get you to the final. A three for Mills. Trains it from beyond the arc. Mills has got the lead up to 14 now for the Nets. Yeah, they're relying on their three-point shooting and getting pretty good results. Little under two and a half minutes off the clock now here in the third. Time out, time out. And Kevin Durant signing an extension this past offseason. Locked in with the Nets for the next four years. Seems like there's a very good chance Durant could end his career in Brooklyn. Take a moment to look at the 2K leaderboard and see last year's high-scoring teams. The Nets. Second. I just loved how this team attacked their opponents you could see their confidence grow as the year went on and, and the points really started to pile up Third quarter of basketball here in just a little under three and a half minutes gone by. There's Garland. Brown trying to free himself up. That is good. And the Nets' lead is cut down now to just 12 points with the basket from Garland. Brooklyn with the ball. They're on a 10-2 run here. Durant kicks to Brown. And that's a foul called on Lowry Markinen. That is his first foul of the game. On defense, Cleveland. Here's Irving. Again, the Nets for two. You just never know where the shots are going to come from, from Kyrie on the inside. So creative with his finishes. Brown against Drummond. Brown the pass to Okoro. And there's the foul. It'll go on Bruce Brown. That's his third foul of the game. Nets on defense. Lavert the pass to Okoro. Six to shoot. Brown sets a screen for Okoro. That is good. And the Nets' lead is cut down to just 12 points with the basket from Brown. Pass to Brown. Outside, KD. And it's off from three-point range. And so Garland will bring it up for the Cavaliers. Markinen finds Brown. The putback, it's good on the putback. Disappointing as a player to have such a great game and still be trailing. Not over yet, though. Pass to Drummond. 
And here's Mills. Drummond the screen. Now here's Mills. Not a lot of room. Drummond with a screen on Levert. And inside the line. That's tipped. And they'll keep possession. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. Garland dishes to Brown. Back to Levert. Inside. There's Garland. The dunk and the foul. A powerhouse move. And he's got a chance for one more at the line. Andre Drummond picks one up. And guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Nets? They keep piling up the assists and they haven't the cooled lanes. off Find the at all. They have not Good wasted shot. any time here tonight. They've pushed it whenever they've had the opportunity and have gotten a lot of fast break points out of it. Nicholas Claxton's checked in for Andre Drummond. Now Darius Garland, another one of those players who is in the second generation of NBA appearances. His father played seven seasons in the league and has got to be very proud of all of his effort. Brown the pass to KD. No good from 18. The Cavaliers trail by seven. Over to the left wing. Markinen kicks to Garland. Okoro passes to Levert. Over Irving. On the money from 12 feet away. Levert's got four points this quarter. And this has been a great job of just getting into the middle of that defense and really scoring effectively from the paint. Maybe the halftime break was good for him. Allowed him to step back, calm himself down, get himself in the right frame of mind, and now shots are falling. Brown with a screen on Irving. There's Garland. It's Levert on the wing. No good on the triple. A good board there, Kevin, but overall they're getting slightly out-rebounded. Claxton, no good. And what should have been a simple pass and finish ends up in a missed opportunity on that alley-oop attempt. Yeah, you'd like to keep things a little more simple, and that was a play that didn't quite develop the way they wanted it. The Nets have only one missed free throw. They've had five attempts and made four of them. That free throw good from Durant. Think about the resume of one Kevin Durant. NBA titles, regular season and finals, MVP awards. A guy in that 50-40-90 club. I mean, you name it. Kevin Durant has done it in the NBA. He is an all-time great. Edwards, he's checked in for the Nets. And good on the second, so he makes him both. Just solid. Really one of the very best there is at the free throw line. Garland looking it over. It's Levert on the wing. That's good, and it's Garland with the assist. Garland's got three assists now in this one. Uh, he can be just lethal from the perimeter. Even though he didn't get good looks in the first quarter, will that make right there? That could change things. Irvin, here he goes. Yes, indeed, it is good. He's now 8 for 14. Uh, he's put on a shooting display here in the second half. He really seems to be in a great groove right now. The Cavaliers trail by 8. And the Cavaliers call time here. We've seen Kevin Durant really having a great game. And he's just attacking the rim with force here. They need to try and deny him the ball in the paint to keep him away from the basket.
Well, Marcus Aldridge is checked in for Kevin Durant. Rajon Rondo is checked in for Cleveland. defense Brooklyn led by as many as 14 points the pass to Stevens and the foul called on Edwards that is his first foul of the game and the Cavaliers making a change here Osman's checked in to the left wing. Love with the screen on it. And it's sent back by Aldridge. Irving with a clean look. No good from outside. And they had some boxed coverage that turned into no coverage. And there's the whistle on the shot. Took the foul. Shot misses. He'll be shooting two. Uh, although he's a bit smaller, Rondo knows he's got to outthink guys on the interior. And that time, drew the contact. The Cavaliers have been excellent at the free throw line here today. A flawless six for Shoot six. Two. And team stats last season, 74% shooting. So some numbers that they can definitely improve upon. That one is off. Wow. Well, what, do you have something in his eye on that shot? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. And he can't get the second one to drop either. Coming up empty that time. Yeah, when Rondo gets motivated, and we've seen that now for a good stretch, he's as valuable as it gets. Edwards finds Mills. Shoots over Lavert. No good off the front iron. And so it's Rondo bringing it up for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Trailing here by eight. The Cavaliers again can't hit. Brooklyn's gone three or five with the long ball since entering the second half. Edwards inside. Pass to Claxton. Here's Mills. Lock at six. From deep three-point range. And they get it back. Claxton. And the rebound paying off as they pick up two on the second chance bucket right there. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. The Cavaliers trail by 10. Now here's Rondo. He has five. Love outside. Pass to Levert from downtown. That ball, great assist by Love. Levert's got 10 points now just in this quarter. From range, Levert's one of those guys you have to respect his shot. He, he makes enough from beyond where you have to honor him. That's nice vision there. You see that pass, you make the feed before the defense has a chance to react, and that opens up a, a much better opportunity to score. And for the Cavaliers, they're shooting from the field. 44%, not bad. Wallace with it, guarded now by Irving. Here's Osman. Off target with his three. Yeah, just a solid job on the backboard. They are really controlling the inside. Nice ball movement by Brooklyn. Irving kicks to Edwards. Passes to Aldridge. Edwards dishes to Aldridge. Clock at four. There's the pass to Irving. This one for three. Knocks down the three ball. Irving's got two now from beyond the arc in the third for Brooklyn. Kyrie loves to dance around with the ball. He seems to look through his defender at spots on the floor he wants to get to and invariably gets there. Love outside. Back to Rondo. Love with the screen on Irving. And it's Rondo penetrating. And he finishes nicely on the layup. Rondo's got his third basket of the night right there. 
He sees the court so well, Rondo. As soon as the lane opened up, he was all over it. Nets leading by 10. Outside Irving. Now here's Mills. Lavert defending. There's the pick. Claxton the pass to Irving. That one's not going to go. And it's the Cavaliers taking it the other way. Pass to Austin. That's good. And it's Lavert with the assist. Lavert's got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. 104 left in the third. Irving kicks to Edwards. On the wing, Irving. He's covered by Rondo. And it's Kevin Love with the foul. That's foul number two for him. Curry's checked in for Brooklyn. Fifty-four seconds left to play here in the third. Edwards with the screen for Irving. Driving in. Four on the clock. And again, it's the Nets missing. The Cavaliers trail by eight. Pass to Levert. Here's Steffens. He feeds it to Love. Outside Rondo. It's Levert on the wing. is it to Osman and there's the whistle three second violation Nets leading by eight and really the smart thing would be to hold for the last shot every second right now is valuable to you that should be their strategy Now Irving, the three, and so it's the Brooklyn Nets holding on to an eight-point lead heading into the break. They're feeling very confident, shooting the ball with great efficiency and dictating the pace. We'll return shortly. And it's time to bring up the State Farm assist of the game. And he's always been uh, the favorite to bag this honor. These kind of feeds are his bread and butter. It doesn't happen with every point guard in the league as far as setting your teammates up. Lots more scores now, but right there creating the scoring opportunity for his teammate. And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth and final quarter. Duran is out there with Bruce Brown. And there's Seth Kerr. And it's Kyrie Irving, and it's Claxton in its center. So that's the lineup for Brooklyn. And Nicholas Claxton gets the whistle that time. That'll be his second foul of the game. The Cavaliers trail by eight. Garland dishes to Markinen. And the pass to Garland. Now, here's Okoro, guarded by Kirk. And it's blocked. Here's Love. That's good. Basket number five on a five for eight night shooting. And so it's Irving. He brings it up for Brooklyn. Out of bounds, Cleveland takes possession. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Got a hand on it. A little over a minute of the fourth quarter gone right now. Curry kicks to Durant. Irving with three. Love grabs the board. Love's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Down low. Here's Markinen. That falls. Clean assist by Love. 
That's seven points for Lowry Markinen. And how about the D was excellent there. Well, Markin is just so skilled and with that size still able to finish. Right, this guy's got a chance to be special. The Cavaliers trail by six. And here is Garland. The shot by Markin and nobody around. And a miss there on the triple. And we're around two minutes into the fourth quarter here. Brown against Garland. The wide open look for Durant. Misses the three. The Cavaliers have gone two for five on field goal attempts in the fourth quarter. Pass to Okoro. And there's Love. That's good on the assist from Okoro. Okoro's got three assists in the game. Brooklyn leading by four. Irving attacking. He kicks to Brown. Gets it to fall from the right block. And Kyrie with that feel. Man, it's so special. Impressive. Finds a teammate. That's a direct guy. And over two and a half minutes in the books here in the fourth. Garland the pass to Stevens. Now Markinen launches a three. They get the rebound. Pass to Okoro. Back to Love. Just five to shoot. Love with the screen on Kerr. Here's Okoro. Good. Nice job down low. Okoro making the right decision that time to keep it and score it. Brooklyn's gotten off to an 0 for 2 start from downtown here in the fourth quarter. Here's Irving. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. He gets on Lowry Markinen. And you know what? You allow a guy to get right to the rim like that, that's your only option. First free throw is good. We're still waiting for that first miss from the line this half. Browns checked in for Kevin Love. Both free throws good from Kyrie Irving. A look at the clock, a little under three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth. Garland, the pass to Brown. Looking to end his cold spell. Arkanen can't get it to go. A slight advantage for them in the rebound department, but that oftentimes is all it takes. And that's a lesson for the D. Fight harder on the glass. Yeah, you just can't afford to give up second chance opportunities again and again. Outside Garland. Passes it to Markinen. Cleveland moving it around. Okoro kicks to Markinen. Irving against Garland. From seven. In deep, Okoro drops it in. And now, just a two-point Nets lead. For Brooklyn, they've gone two for five. Ron field goal attempts in the fourth quarter. Irving for three. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Okoro dishes to Garland. Brown with a screen on Katie. Here's Markinen. And Durant sends it back. Instinct, timing, length. KD, great deep. Takes the alley of cash and dunks it down. And you can see him give a little nod and then just burst to the rim for the alley-oop slam. A pair of teammates, Greg, with a terrific feel for each other. Outside, marking it. That three off the mark. 
Yeah, the three-pointer has not been his weapon in this one. He had one in the first quarter and still zero here in the second. Garland, the pass to Stevens. A crossover and block. That one goes careening off the glass. Down kicks to Durant. And the three off target. The Cavaliers trail by four. There's Garland. Yep, that one goes in there. Garland's got 10 points here in the second half. Now, Garland started the game at 6-1, but the way he's playing now, he's got to be feeling seven feet tall. And that's a foul called on Lowry Markinen. That's his third foul of the game. Harris LaVert's checked in for Cleveland. Irving against Garland. Irving passes to Kerr. Outside Durant, shot clock at three. And a great assist by Curry as that one goes in. Curry's got his fourth assist in this one. The pass to Okoro. And it's out of bounds. The Nets will take it the other way. And the Nets with possession here. Leading by five. Irving dishes to Brown. Outside Durant. Pass to Brown. Here's Claxton in the corner. Irving with it. Shot clock at five. Pass to Claxton. Garland with the rebound. And so it's Garland who brings up the ball for the Cavaliers. And, and what a day on the glass for a guy who's given up a lot of size out on the floor. Irving against Garland. And Curry has it in the corner. On deep. And again, Brooklyn with the triple. And yeah, that's back-to-back -back threes. The D just seems to be slacking off a little bit. Brown with a screen on Irving. It's Levert on the wing. Here's Brown. And it's in. Basket number six for him thus far. He has only missed two shots from the floor. And the D not really doing its job there. A, a little slow to react to the ball getting into the paint. And Brooklyn making a change here. Drummond's checked in. Okay, well, let's check in with David Aldridge who's reporting from the sidelines. And during that last break, guys, I got a chance to hear Steve Nash talking to his team. He told them, this is a game of runs. It's a game of momentum. You may have the lead now, but I'm telling you guys, it can evaporate in a hurry. Let's close this thing out. Kevin? Thanks so much, David. KD on the wing. Shoots over Brown. And again, it's the Nets missing. The Cavaliers trail by six. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Here's LaVert. Andre Drummond grabs the miss. Drummond's got four rebounds in this game. Here's Irving. And it's blocked by Brown. They retain possession. And the call will be against Karis LeVert. That's his first foul. And the Cavaliers making a change here. Love's checked in. To the middle. Unloads from nine. That one goes. Counting. And the Nets lead by eight. And great job of screening there. Nice job to take it to the rim and get the finish. 
Well, Cleveland shooting at 42% in this final quarter. Timeout called the Cavaliers. We've seen Kevin Durant really having a great game. Yeah, smart move here. Talk things over. He's really eating them up, and they've tried a few different looks defensively. Nothing quite getting it done. Outside Garland, and there's the call on Kyrie Irving. That's his first foul. Okoro kicks to Brown, and there's the foul. It'll go on Bruce Brown. That will get him his fourth foul of the game. Lavert with it. Love with the screen on Kirk. Count it. Lavert's got 12 points in just the second half. Are we sure that's the same player, guys? He looks completely different. What confidence he's playing with, and look how engaged he is on both ends. Garland against Irving. Passes it to KD. And Curry has it in the corner. Drummond with a screen on Levert. Stolen by Levert. And it's out of bounds. The Nets will take it the other way. Nets leading by six. And the shot is long. If you told me this was the kind of game he was going to have, I would not have expected them to be in front right now. Arlen kicks to Okoro. It's a pick by Love. Okoro with it, guarded now by Durant. Curry with the steal. And there's the pass to KD. Irving dishes to Curry. And another turnover here by Brooklyn. And so Garland will bring it up for the Cavaliers. Timeout, timeout. timeout called Cleveland.
with the screen on Irving. Lost to Love. Six on the shot clock. Pass to Levert. Over Curry. And another miss by Cleveland. Nets leading by six. Puts it up from 12. That's good, and it's KD with the assist. Durant's got five assists in the game. Hell, Cleveland shooting from the field. 44%, not bad. It's Levert on the wing. Love with the screen for Levert. Pass to Love. Shoots over Curry. And they force the shot clock violation. Great team. One thing we've seen from these guys is excellent passing. No doubt about it. It's fun to watch the way they're operating as a team right now. They are all in sync. Outside Durant. Curry on the wing. Levert defending. Again, the Nets for two. Another good play. This is how they built the lead. Calling on the right guys at the right time. Basketball IQ is something that gets talked about, but it's importance to a team showing up here, running plays that turn into scores. Garland against Irving, and he comes up with the deuce. Garland's got 24. Well, Garland's able to work around the defense that time. Pretty agile from the small guard. Now, here is Irving. He can't get it to go. Garland with the defensive end. The pass to Levert. Brown against Garland. Pass to Brown. Over Drummond. It'll go, and the next lead has got down to just six points on the bucket from Brown. Well, to have a long career in the league, I think Garland's going to have to be more of an assist maker. And they go to the intentional foul. Irving against Garland. Irving double team. No one near Curry as he lets it go. Offline with his three. Can't waste any time here. Well, it's probably a little bit too late here, but we really need to score a bucket here to stay alive. So far, he's a can't-miss player. A superb scorer who plays to his strength. And so they choose to intentionally foul. First one drops, and that puts them up by far. And so both free throws are good, and it's a six-point ball game. Some padding here on the free throw line, some good work.
23 seconds left to play here in the fourth. Pass to Garland. Three pointer. Rebounded by the Nets. They've led by as many as 14 points. And now we've got the intentional foul. You have to foul, but I'm sure they would have liked to foul someone different. the first one and that makes it a seven point lead throws here. So now it's an eight-point game. Now, Garland. The tray. And it's Osman missing. So it's the Nets picking up the win. A confident win and one where they clearly showed the greater effort. Yeah, I mean, it was a solid performance, uh, particularly here at home. Uh, I think they built off that edge of being here and, and playing with just a little more confidence than their opponent. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much, Seth. Satisfying home win. What does the support feel like in front of these fans? Oh, it's great. Great home court. They bring that energy every game, uh, even when we're struggling. So, uh, I mean, it's much appreciated, and it, it felt good to get this win for them. It was a team effort and a crowd effort as well. Congrats. Back to you. All right, David, great job. Thanks so much. And that'll do it, folks. So for David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, Brent Berry, and the whole 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for being with us. Now let's check out our New Balance player of the game, Kevin Durant.